Angioplasty and stenting procedures are performed using small catheters that are about two millimeters in diameter. And we place these catheters either at the radial artery at the wrist or at the femoral artery at the top of the thigh. Using continual x-rays, we watch the catheters or we, as we thread them up through the aorta and over to the heart, either from the top of the thigh or over from the wrist. Once we get to the heart, we look specifically at the coronary arteries, which are the arteries that supply blood flow to the heart muscle. There are three major arteries that supply blood flow. The LAD, or left anterior descending, that comes down the front of the heart. The circumflex coronary artery that comes around the side of the heart. Or the RCA, or right coronary artery, that comes around the back of the heart. In the early era, uh, we did angioplasty alone, which was the use of balloons to open up these narrowings. But those narrowings tended to reclose pretty quickly. So in the 90s, when stents were developed, those were used as small metal scaffolds to prop the artery open. And at this point, we have the newest generation of stents where issues of re-narrowing are much less than they were 10 or even 20 years ago. The way we do the procedure is when we bring the catheter up to the heart artery and we find that there's a narrowing, let's say in this case in the circumflex coronary artery, we thread a wire that goes in from the leg, comes up to the heart, and goes down the coronary artery. We use this wire as sort of a train track for us to then send a balloon first to open up this narrowing a bit. So we, push, we put the balloon into the area of narrowing and inflate it. And once we've made an opening, we place a stent, which again is that metal scaffold that keeps the artery open. When the procedure is completed, all of these wires and catheters come out of the body, and we may decide to use a small suture device to close up the area where we've gone in in the leg, or we may use a little uh, inflatable band to close up the artery at the wrist. 